When the announcement was made that FM25 was delayed until March, we took it upon ourselves here at FM Scout to create a download for you guys for FM24 to almost bridge the gap. Now that download included updated transfers and updated league positions, but it also included new Wonder Kids. And today we're going to be taking a look at some of the best new Wonder Kids in that download. These are all players that do not exist in FM24 otherwise. Now, I'm not going to go into every detail about what that download includes on top of the things I already mentioned and how to set it up. There is a whole video about that already a few videos back. You'll find it on the channel pretty easily. But we really do think it's the best way to play FM24 right now. And the new Wonder Kids definitely add an extra level to it. Now, there's plenty of great Wonder Kids in this database. Today, I'm going to highlight some of my favorites. And I just want to quickly mention something before we start. So one example of a great Wonder Kid that we've added to the game that isn't in FM24 24 is Justin Lerma, a 15-year-old Ecuadorian that is moving to Borussia Dortmund. Now, just to let you know, all of these guys will have similar potential to some of your favorite superstar wonder kids that are already in FM24, but they might not look as good on their attributes on paper. The reason this was done was because a lot of these wonder kids are starting off younger than everybody else. So, for example, most of these are 14, 15-year-olds. There's a couple of 16-year-olds, but because of that, we didn't want their attributes to already be the level of say the 17 and 18 year old wonder kids that you know else they're going to develop way above everyone else with those extra years of development that they're going to have so their attributes might not look as good as some but bear in mind they are younger so there's more time to reach that potential so if you actually went quite a few years into your save you would suddenly see these attributes will balance out way quicker than you would have thought in justin lerma's case he has got a current ability of 73 and a potential ability of 155 that's in a randomized potential range um obviously he's on the higher end because he's a great wonder the kid but because there is a big gap between the current and potential ability it won't take too long before he starts to close that gap and by the time he's 17 like most of the wonder kids you already know he will look on a similar level to those guys so don't worry about the fact that some of them might not look amazing straight away but with that being said let's get into our list where i've got 13 players that i want to showcase to you guys if you enjoy this video smash the like button for us and comment down below any wonder kids you wanted to see in game and i'll let you know if they're in the database subscribe if you haven't already and let's get right into it and we start off with one of my favorite wonder kids that Sir Tavares has added and that's just a quick shout out Sir Tavares is the man behind this particular file these new wonder kids that you can choose to have on or off by the way when you download the full updated FM25 download that we created but yes Gabriel Mech is a very good player playing at Gremio in Brazil his valuation is pretty cheap but obviously he is only 15 so you won't be able to bring him to your team for a long while as you can see uh, because of his age he can't move until any time in the near future to England England. if you're in a different country it might be a little bit different but yes right now he isn't available but by the time he's 17 18 you might want to start scouting him and potentially bring him to your side because he's got some great attributes already for a 15 year old brilliant first touch dribbling flair he's good with both feet as well an excellent attacking midfielder who I believe in real life Chelsea have been looking at um there's a lot of rumors at least that Chelsea were going to sign him he's got a pretty high potential range and I will just show you just for this example what he looks like so he's got a current ability of 60 because he's only 15 but he's got a potential ability of 171 so if you were to go two years or three years into your save he would start looking like a very good player his current ability would probably be 100 or more by that point providing he's getting some decent development at Gremio and that's when he'll look like a very good wonder kid who might be able to fulfill that potential so bear all that in mind as mentioned they're not going to look crazy good straight away because they are younger but Gabriel Mech is certainly a superb talent. Manchester United have a couple of great youngsters that have been added with this new Wonder Kid pack. One of them is Imar Ibrahimov, who is a 15-year-old English slash Russian player who's in Manchester United's under 18s when you use this new download. Now he has got a valuation of about 1 million quid, can play on the left or through the middle, and has some very nice attributes to start with, particularly if you're using him as some kind of creative midfielder. 13 passing, 13 vision, and 14 technique at 15 is crazy good. Great first touch and dribbling as well. Clearly some weaknesses in his game, but they can be worked on in no time the physicals are one of those areas that you probably would want to improve but he's a very bright young talent that I think if you got your hands on and gave him some development could easily become one of the world's best midfielders with attributes like this at 15 with loads of potential to grow I can really see him becoming a top draw player but now let's move on to one of the two best players in this database in fact he is probably my favorite because he has a potential range of minus 95 which only two new wonder kids have you might be thinking what does a minus 95 potential range 
range mean? It means when you load up a save, his potential will fall between 160 and 190 out of 200. So you can imagine just how good he can be. This is Guile Fernandez, whose name I've probably butchered there, a Barcelona player who is 15. His valuation isn't too high. I'm sure Barcelona will want to give him a new contract soon, though, with interest in him at the start of a save already from Atletico Madrid, because at 15, I mean, he's a great passer, good first touch, dribbling the determinations there, lots of great mental attributes too, and some nice physicals to go alongside it. Again, not the final article, but to look this good at 15 definitely bodes well for the future of Barcelona's midfield, because he looks like an unreal talent. A player that is certainly more potential over starting ability is Wisdom Mike, who is a left winger, great with both feet, playing at Bayern Munich, and you might look at him and think, wow, he looks awful. I will just say he definitely isn't, because he's got some great potential, one of the top 10 potential wonder kids added to the game. He's got a potential range of 150 to 180, is valued at about 2 million, and the reason he might not look great straight away is he's only 14. So by the time you'd actually try and sign him, when he's 17, 18 or whatever, he would have had three or four four years of growth at Bayern Munich's youth level and by then he will be a totally different player as he fills the gap between his current and potential ability so he's even younger than most so give him a chance but always keep a scout on wisdom might because at some point he will explode into a top player. Lil have got a 15 year old French talent valued at 8 million pounds with great starting ability great potential and a name that I'm going to attempt to pronounce as Ayub Bawidi Again, probably very, very wrong there, but you know, I've never heard of this guy before up until now, so you can give me some slack there at least. But he is a fantastic passer already at such a young age, a good midfield option who is definitely more forward thinking by the looks of it than he is defensive, but there's good first touch there, good decision making, composure, the dribbling's decent too. Again, 15 in a couple years, this guy will have some green attributes already in the passing department. The determination is looking good too, a resolute personality, a very talented option. Again, I'm looking at some of the best potential wonder kids here in game. There's plenty others that I won't cover, but these guys all have huge potential and can easily be world-class superstars. We've still got plenty of players to go in this list though, but I just want to take a second to do a subtle plug and let you guys know that I do have my own channel also linked in the description. Over there I do more Football Manager content, so if you enjoy me and just Football Manager content in general, rebuilds, new wonder kids, whatever it might be, come and check it out. There's plenty of content over there, but let's get back to the player list where we have a fantastic talent, Amara Diouf, who is a 15-year-old Senegalese international who is apparently playing for Generation Foot but is joining FC Mets. I don't know too much about him personally, but I know in-game he has got big potential and some great starting attributes as well. The 15-year-old, already an international, is crazy, so he's clearly got a big, big future. We'll see what he can turn into in your saves. At Mets in the second tier, he might even get some game time in a couple years and then start to develop even more. So keep an eye on him, and I'm sure you will see a great player blossom here. What about the English Wonder Kids though? Well, fear not. There is a brilliant, brilliant 14-year-old playing for Leeds called Harry Gray, who is the brother of current Tottenham player and former Leeds player, Archie Gray. I don't know if they've actually got that on his information here. I don't think they will do. Oh, they actually do. There you go. Archie Gray is his brother. Andy Gray is his dad. So you can clearly see there is a footballing legacy in this lad. He's only 14. He's already been given an A rating by our scouts here, and you can see why. He's got great attributes for the age, valued at only a million quid or so. If you can bring him in and give him the chance, put him in your youth team. By the time he's 17, 18, you will have one of the best young strikers around with huge potential and great ability already. He is going right to the very top. One that might struggle a little bit because he is a goalkeeper is Massimo Pessina of Bologna. One of the top 10 wonder kids that Ser Tavares has added to the game in terms of potential, but being a goalie, it's quite unlikely he will get the chance to grow. So you might have to wait even longer on this one, but if someone gives him the opportunity, whether on loan or if he leaves Bologna at the end of his contract, he will soon blossom into one of the world's best goalkeepers. He has the potential to do so. I will just show you in this case, 174 potential, 55 current ability. So you can imagine how quick he will grow, trying to fill that gap. 174 for a goalkeeper in terms of potential means if he reaches that, he will definitely be Italy's number one. He'll probably be the best goalkeeper in world football. So there is clearly a player there, but being so young, you'll have to give it time. But if you gave him a chance, 
chance, you will not regret it. Another 14 year old in Brazil is Nadson Juan, who is playing for Santos, a team that has produced lots of great players in the past in Brazil, namely Neymar and Pele. If Nadson Juan can somehow follow in their footsteps, he will be an unreal player. He's only a couple million quid, but at 14, again, his attributes aren't amazing yet. Give him some time, keep an eye on him. Whether it's left wing or right wing, he has the potential to be one of the best in the world in that area if he gets given the opportunity to grow. So get your scout report on him, check him out and see how he develops. For our next player, we're off to Manchester United, Chido Obi Martin, one of the most talked about young players in world football, formerly of Arsenal, scored tons of goals at youth level and then moved to Manchester United and is expected to have a very big future. The Danish forward is valued at around 10 million quid here and he has big, big potential. Again, some of you might look at him and say he doesn't look as good as what I've heard in real life, but again, 15, give him some years and he certainly will because he's got really high potential. The current ability will see the gap between the potential and before you know it, he'll start to fill out and look like a completely different player in no time. So definitely keep an eye on him. If you're at Manchester United, you've got two great youngsters that we've looked at already that you're going to have in your youth ranks. But alongside Guilla Fernandez at Barcelona, the other highest rated wonder kid that has been added by Sir Tavares is Francesco Camada, who is breaking records for AC Milan's youth team. I don't know if he has made an impact in the first team yet, but there's a lot of talk that he will soon. And he is so, so young. The Italian forward has been spoken about for a couple of years, actually. And he's got some of the biggest potential in game. Again, a minus 95 player. So his potential will fall between 160 and 190. So you are guaranteed a world-class forward in every save, providing he gets some development he will become amazing so scout him keep an eye on him and i imagine within your first year or two he will be tearing up at youth level ready to make an impact in the ac milan first team squad what a player up next though is a 15 year old belgium center back at ajax by the name of jorfi mokio who is a player that has a lot of potential as all of these do a left-footed defender who has some good attributes to start with six foot decent physical some good mental attributes in there as well some nice tackling and heading given some time some development he'll fill out physically very quickly between the ages of 15 to 18 you see a lot of physical growth in young players so he'll look like a very different talent physically in no time and then before you know it those mentals and technicals will iron out to be a very good defender and then finally we have the Belgian youngster who is being tipped as the next Eden Hazard in Belgian football Konstantinos Kretsas who is playing for Genk out in Belgium I believe he has now been given first team appearances I may be wrong but he is certainly on the brink of it if he hasn't already he is very very highly talked about passing vision technique dribbling first touch determination flair some great physical attributes as well to go alongside it a left footed attacking midfielder he's definitely one to keep an eye on and six million might look like a lot but if in a few years he's still valued at that and he has developed he is going to be certainly worth the money so make sure you keep an eye on him and there's some of the best new wonder kids that have been added to the game i'd love to hear what you think of them go and check them out in your saves hopefully you can have some success with them obviously it's not quite fm25 but we did our best all of these downloads and files we're speaking about aren't made by professional people that work for sports interactive they're done by fans of the game who like to mod the game so if there are any issues let us know we can fix it for example cheeto obi martin was at Arsenal but we've now updated that transfer pack so he is now at Manchester United so if you find any issues with it let us know down below but thank you for watching and I'll see you next time goodbye